think I was too young and naive to be intimidated, to tell you the truth. And, and the dyes, um, there's not really much intimidating about them. They're just genuine, good, solid Midwestern people. And I related well to them. And I was fortunate um, in both Texas and Colorado to be under the, the watch of a guy named Rod Whitman, who's a very successful Canadian architect. And he, too, kind of took me under his wing and uh, taught me as much as, as he could in the construction side of it. I always knew I wanted to be in the design side of it as well. And when you're working with the dyes, at least I felt my position with them would be more on a, spe on a specific golf course that's being constructed. So I'd be on one project for maybe two years, three years. Uh, whereas in a more traditional operation, uh, and when I went to work for Reese, I could have my hands on five or six projects in all different phases of construction, design, development. So I really, my learning curve was going to be a lot quicker uh, with somebody like Reese. And the dice, they understood that, and they, um, they were very influential in me getting that job with Reese.